Guys, this is going to be a bit of an odd comparison, I think, uh, because if you guys have seen some of my openings from Fusion Strike or Darkness Ablaze, I don't know, you might know that Darkness Ablaze is my least favorite set of the entire Sword and Shield sets, uh, or of, of the entire Sword and Shield era, I should say. Um, there's no alternate arts in Darkness Ablaze, there are in Fusion Strike, and it's a pretty popular set right now. Although, the pull rates are really tough on Fusion Strike, but so they are in Darkness Ablaze, and the, 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 the only, like, kinda chase there is the Charizard V Max, apparently, it's not even a full art, it's just the V Max. Uh, from Charizard, so my assumption would be that Fusion Strike would take the win here easily, but let's find out. Um, I think there are gold cards and rainbows in the in Darkness of Blaze as well, um, but I mean, I don't know. Let's let's find out which one will win this. Uh, it's pretty. Um, <laughs> funny that after I pulled the after I pulled the the Lugia and uh, no not the Lugia the Rayquaza from Silver Tempest I said like I'm not gonna open a lot of Sword and Shield anymore and basically the only thing I've been doing so far in, in these videos uh, is opening Sword and Shield, <laughs> so I'm not really being true, true to my word in, uh, in, in in that sense. Um, but to be honest, like it was not really, it's not really big videos. It were like three packs all the time uh, from uh, Fusion Strike, Brilliant Stars, and, and Crown Zenith. So I don't know, I don't know. Um, there's just this one half boosted box from Fusion Strike that I still have like separate from a sealed case of these half boosted boxes. And it's the only Darkness of Blaze booster box, half boosted box that I still have left. And like if there's one set that I don't need to save uh, a particular product from per se, I would say it's Darkness of Blaze. Because it's just my least favorite. But let's open these up. <laughs> let's open these up. <laughs> And let's see um, how bad today's opening will be. be because this is probably, I don't know, like from all the booster boxes and ETBs that I've opened, this is probably the least exciting one. Um, I don't know, the toughest pull rates probably, but let's find out. Let's start with one of Darkness Ablaze. The first uh, and only half booster box that I have opened from Darkness of Blaze before was um, uh, was really bad. I only had three pulls, and they were only V cards, regular Vs. So let's see if we can get something better than a regular V. First pack here. Let's find out what we get out of Darkness of Blaze. Reverse Hollow Dunsparce. And a regular rare Delcaddy. Nothing special there. Fusion Strike. Of course, there's a lot more potential in Fusion Strike, so that's why I also believe Fusion Strike will easily win this today. Uh, I don't say that, say that very often, because Fusion Strike have some, has some of the worst pull rates in Sword and Shield, but at least there are some good cards in it. <laughs> well, let's find out here. So, Fusion Strike, Simacy Reverse, and a regular rare Zerora. Yeah. So, nothing in the first packs here. I'm not gonna go through every card, of course. Like, we're opening basically a full booster box here if we count all the packs together. Alright. So, four from the back. 
Darkness Ablaze. Reverse Almost Aravia and a regular rare Wigglytuff. Yeah. <laughs> I really have my doubts on this. I really have my doubts. Come on. This video should not be longer than half an hour, I think. Uh, we should be able to open it within half an hour, for sure. If my, vo if my voice sounds a little bit off today, it's because I just had a festival last weekend uh, at the moment that I'm, re that I'm recording this and I'm, I lost a bit of my voice. So, Fusion Strike, Reverse Hollow Voltorb and a regular rare Absol. So, nothing yet out of either set. I don't know what the price on these booster boxes will be by the time this is uploaded. Um, I doubt Darkness of Blaze will have risen a lot. Like I bought this half booster box uh, like just under 70 euros. Um, like, I don't know, half a year ago, something like that. And uh, I don't know I don't think it will rise that much maybe fusion strike will rise it has been risen it has been rising uh, since I've bought it but I don't know how much it, its value is right now we have a reverse hollow cup chew and a hollow squeak now to be honest that's a pretty nice that's a pretty awesome hollow it's it's not a valuable one but it's a really cool hollow from fusion strike uh, and it's the first one here for today so third pack I think or fourth is it the fourth is the third the third Reverse Hollow Ampharos, Darkness Blaze, and a regular rare Flygon, so still nothing. Wow. Ooh. I'm having uh, deja vus, I'm having flashbacks. Um, the thing is, I also said before, I would not open any specific... I, no, I said I would not do a specific video on Darkness Blaze. Now, <clears throat> that is... I mean, it's not only Darkness Blaze that we're doing today, so technically it, 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 it isn't, but we were still opening Darkness Blaze. I wasn't really planning on it back then, but we got Reverse Hollow, Simapore, and a regular Red Blissey. Wow, I think this might have been a very bad idea. <laughs> I think this might have been a very bad idea. Oh god. Open three packs of each. Uh, pulled nothing but one hollow. Uh, all right. Let's see. We got a reverse hollow Lipard and a regular rare Darmanitan. Oh god. <laughs> oh, this is not gonna be fun. I feel like this is not going to be a fun opening. I mean, I was prepared for that. I was prepared for that. Uh, if we get more than six pulls in total here, it's a good, it's a good opening. <laughs> it's a good opening. But so far, it's not. It doesn't seem too promising. Uh, fusion strike. Come on. We got reverse hollow spongy gloves and a hollow swampert. Ah, please don't own, don't don't just give us hollows. Don't just give us some hollows. Man, come on, 
Reverse Alos Carmory. Jesus Christ. <laughs> uh, wow. Like, we have nothing from Fusion Strike left, uh, yet, still, and still, Darkness Blaze is doing worse. <laughs> Unbelievable. Reverse all Fusion Strike energy, and a regular rare Verizion. God damn. Wow. Man, I hope the second half of these... I mean, it's not, you would not really call it the second half. But I hope later on the box or the boxes get better. Because so far, it's brutal. It's really brutal. So, Darkness of Blaze. Reverse Hollow Flygon. Okay, Center Scorch V first hit for Darkness of Blaze. And with that, Darkness of Blaze is actually in the lead. How about that? But I got a feeling that it is not going to stay that way. I got a feeling that it's not going to stay that way. All right, come on. We got Fusion Strike, Reverse Hollow Phalanx, and a regular rare Gloister. Fusion Strike is not doing good. It's not doing good. Yeah, these sets... These sets are brutal to open. Is this going to be... The most brutal opening I've done? On the channel? I mean, I think we should at least get three hits out of each box. If that's not the case, then it's probably the worst that I've had. Reverse all our Rose Tower from Darkness Ablaze and a regular rare Mel Metal. Oh. I don't know what to think, guys. I don't know what to think. Like, luckily, I'm not. I haven't like paid hundreds of, of, of euros for these boxes, so it's not a huge loss, but either way, you still hope for something, right? I mean, for Darkness of Blaze, ain't no way that you get your value back, even if you get the Charizard. You're only halfway there. Reverse Hollow Skarmory and a regular rare Palos and from Fusion Strike. I haven't pulled anything from Fusion Strike yet. Still, God, this is like the seventh pack for each, I think. Let me let me see how many code cards we have. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, wait. 15? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. How is it 15? Did we just open one from Darkness of Blaze? We did, right? Oh, yeah, we should... Should pick one. Oh yeah, we just opened one from Darkness of Blaze, so it's... <laughs> oh, I'm messing this up. So, the seventh pack. I think there is something, maybe, from Fusion Strike. In the seventh pack, finally a hit. Let's find out. Or nothing. <laughs> Reverse Hollow Carvana and a Hollow Obstagoon, so... Still nothing. Wow. Wow. Three hollows and nothing else from Fusion Strike. Oof. Man, and I think the hollows might count as a hit in the in Fusion Strike. So if we get a lot of hollows, that might be a very bad sign. Come on. 
Darkness of Blaze, Reverse Hollow Fledgling, and a regular rare Galarian Mr. Rhyme. It's not really, it's not a very eventful opening. But I think if you know a little bit about Sword and Shield and the sets in it, that you expected that. Well, there's, uh, oh, there's something in here. There's something in here. Question is, is it going to be a regular V? I think I saw a black border, so I think it will be, but who knows? Reverse holo, yeah. Reverse holo Sharpedo and a Cinderace V, which I already have twice. So it's not a very good hit, but at least we got a hit out of each one so far. Why am I even putting the hollows right here? They're not even hits. All right. Well, there's something in Darkness Ablaze. But again, it seems to be a regular V. We got a Reverse Hollow Starly, exactly, and a Crobat V, which I also already have. Like, there's still so many cards that I don't have from Darkness of Blaze. And I'm pulling doubles. I'm only pulling doubles so far. In both, in either set, actually. Come on. And again, Darkness of Blaze is in the lead. Pretty surprising. Reverse Hollow Electros and a regular Red Clay Doll. Wow. And we're halfway in. I think we're halfway in the booster boxes. Oh. I don't know why with darkness of sorry why with darkness of blaze the code cards are like upside down. You know, reverse all relicanth and a Serena regular rare. Oh god. Man, this is brutal. Wow, what will the best card be that we pull today? Chance, chances are it's just gonna be a regular V. Reverse Hollow Frostmoth and a regular rare uh, Luxray. There's a big chance the best card is going to be a regular V. And that's pretty depressing because these cards are worth like sometimes not even a euro, so. Uh, maybe there's something. I think there's something, but... Yeah, there's something. But again, it's a regular V. Oh my god. I'm done with the regular Vs right now. Reverse Holo Rowlet and a Rhyperior V. Now, at least it is one that I didn't have before. So, there's that. So, we already got three hits out of Darkness of Blaze. Chances are that we don't get anything anymore. Um... Uh, because that was my previous experience with Darkness of Blaze, uh, the booster, the half booster box at least. So I still like. Oh, okay, there's something here from Fusion Strike too. So the second hit, second pull. Let's see, Reverse Holochromatic, Chandelure V Max. Okay, so that's definitely the best pull so far. There we go. Well, I'd still say three Vs is better than one V and a regular V max. So Darkness Blaze still in the lead. Yeah, Reverse Hollow Shinotic and a High Dragon regular rare.
Man, there's nothing exciting about this, right? Whoa. I mean, it is possible to get more than three hits, of course, out of the booster boxes. We've seen that with Fusion Strike in the in the verses that we've done in the previous openings. Like I, in total, I opened two of these half booster boxes, and we got uh, one time we got four hits, and the other time we got five hits. So it's definitely possible. Got reverse all cross switcher and a regular rare Arcanine. Okay. Like I don't know from Darkness of Blaze if we are able if we will be able oh, man, I can't speak. Uh if we will be able to get more than three hits out of this. Or if that's a general pull rate. Yeah, reverse all of Simipore and a regular rare Dracozole. So Hmm. <laughs> oh, there's something here from Fusion Strike, but again, it's a <laughs> it's a regular V. Oh God, it's really tough. It's really tough. Reverse Holo Jupiter and a Inteleon V. I think that's a new one for us at least. I don't think I have the Inteleon V. So right now I'd say Fusion Strike is slightly winning because of the V Max. I think it will stay that way. Or not. <laughs> okay, there's this fourth hit in uh, Darkness of Blaze. So it is better than the first booster box that we opened from Darkness of Blaze. At least there's that. We got. Oh, is it a regular V? Reverse Hollow Heat Energy. It's the Butterfree V. Okay, so it's still a regular V. But at least we got more hits than I expected. So there's that. But only regular V so far. Man, this is tough. Come on. Nothing in this one, I think. Reverse Hollow Phantom and a Hollow Landorus. All right. Like, don't tell me that Darkness of Blaze is going to win this. Don't tell me that Darkness of Blaze is going to win this. Because that is really embarrassing. That is going to be really embarrassing for a uh, fusion strike. Darkness of Blaze. Reverse Hollow Snubble and a Hollow Hoopa. That's the first Hollow for Darkness of Blaze. Come on. Man, we're almost through these boxes. Ugh. No, nothing in this one. Reverse all Lux Ray and a regular rare Blissey. Wow, two more packs in each box. Oh. Uh -huh. Man, this was not at all worth worth it value-wise. Not at all. Yeah, I saw some sparkling, but I think it's just the border of the reverse. Because I don't see a black or colored border in this. Or silvered. In the case of Full Art Reverse, Holo Tapu Coco. Yeah, and Darmanitan. Yeah, so that'll definitely be it for Darkness of Blaze, I believe. Question is, will Fusion Strike get one more hit? If if this is it, that is really embarrassing for uh, for Fusion Strike. Really embarrassing. Well, 
Reverse all Pukamuku. Regular rare Palo Sand. Oh god, Fusion Strike. This is bad. This is really bad for Fusion Strike. Losing against Darkness Ablaze? Oh my god. Who would have thought? Who would have thought? Yeah. Well, that's it for Darkness Ablaze. Like I said, it's a little bit better than I expected, but still, like, still only got V's, regular V's. We got three regular V's in the, in the first booster box. Now four regular V's out of this one. Man, this is tough. Is there some last pack magic for Fusion Strike? If we get something, Fusion Strike wins. If we get nothing, Darkness Blaze wins. So it all comes down to this. I think there's something, so I think Fusion Strike will win this. Reverse Holo Copper Raja. Well, and a Appleton V. How exciting. <laughs> How exciting. Oh my god. So, um... <laughs> So we've opened 18 packs of each set. And granted, like, we did do a little bit better than, than I thought, but still, like, Darkness Blaze, four regular Vs out of 18 packs. Ah, it's not even one, one bit better than just a V. Fusion Strike, not much better, actually. Just got one V max. And that's basically it. Like, this is brutal, guys. This is really brutal. Um, now, it is what it is. A slight win for Fusion Strike. But this is probably... Uh, you probably don't want to do this. Um, if you have a, a ton of these products laying around, you might open some of them. But uh, it's, it's, it's not really worth opening um, besides that. Um, I think it's just, if you have a lot of Darkness of Blaze lying around, I think you might just want to sell it um, to some collectors who want to s collect some sealed items. Uh, same for Fusion Strike, but you might want to go for an alternate art maybe. Um, but it's tough, it's really tough. That said guys, I hope you kind of enjoyed this video. Uh, I'm gonna leave it right here. Thank you so much for watching guys Don't forget to subscribe like and share the video also don't forget to check out some of my other openings on the channel Thank you so much and see you guys next time. Bye